Coming up, Inside LSU Gymnastics, a recap of a huge Fighting Tigers meet against Texas Woman's in the Maravich Center on Friday night. We'll also take you behind the scenes and show you for the first time a new social media application for your Fighting Tigers. All of that and so much more coming up from the Malcolm and Pat Ward Squad Room here inside the Gymnastics Training Center on Inside LSU Gymnastics. Inside LSU Gymnastics with DD Bro is brought to you each week by Sigma Engineers. Sigma Engineers is thankful to our clients who trust us year after year and to the commitment of our selfless employees who bring such great talents to our company. With experts in every discipline, our dedication to safety and quality sets us apart as one of the leaders in the petrochemical industry. Woman's Hospital, the best birthday ever is at Woman's. TJ Ribs, legendary Louisiana barbecue, and by Assurance Financial. When you find the home you want to buy, choose a mortgage lender that can help you buy it. David Alello with Insurance Financial. Lending the way home buyers prefer it. Inside LSU Gymnastics with DD Bro is an exclusive presentation of the LSU Sports Television Network. There you are. And here we are inside the Malcolm and Pat Ward squad room at the LSU Gymnastics Training Center here on the campus of LSU in Baton Rouge. This is Inside LSU Gymnastics, and I'm your host, Mike Smith. Well, it was a huge night for the Fighting Tigers on Friday night in the Maravich Center. A big win over Texas Women's University with a big 197 475 score for the Fighting Tigers, who are now 2 0 and atop the standings in the Southeastern Conference, and now 3 0 nationally overall, off to a fantastic start in the 2017 campaign, ranked again second nationally this week. It gives me great pleasure to bring in Hall of Fame head coach Dee Dee Bro into today's broadcast. Dee Dee, another wonderful home meet, and let's start and give it right to the crowd. Almost 12,000 Tiger fans turn out. Wow. Well, it was one of those great Friday night. The weather was, what, 68 degrees. It was amazing. And people came out. They brought their kids, and everybody had a great time. Great show. It really was. It made for a great show on the SEC Network Plus. Got great feedback from folks all over the country who were able to watch it live. Yeah. The PMAC always looks fabulous for a, a home gymnastics meet. And your team, Dee Dee, seemed like they just picked up where they left off a week ago and rock and roll. You know, TWU is a, a great program. They're a different division program, but they compete against the best teams in the country. And we were very, very proud to be able to host them at LSU because they do a terrific job. And we're very good friends with their coaches. So that was wonderful. Um, for us to start on vaulting at home is always fun because we're such a good vaulting team. But the, I'm telling you what, it was, it was a hard <laughs> to get score on Friday night. Our kids did everything they could and we, we came out with a big win. Well, let's go to the highlights brought to you as always by TJ Ribs, the official barbecue restaurant of LSU Athletics located on Sigan Lane and the home mothership on Acadian Thruway as well, Dee Dee. The vaulting was fantastic. And as you said, you fought and clawed for every tenth that yeah. you earned, but still a fantastic effort. Now for the number one vault team again this week in America. Yeah, you know, the, the thing we stress all week long with our kids are stretching their positions. We want that good block with their heads above the horse so that they don't have to pike down their landings. Sarah Finnegan, uh, Lexi Priestman started us off, two great sophomores started us off on that event. And um, we kind of built from that point because everybody after our first two kids did 10-0 start value vaults. Um, Sydney Ewing, a, a really nice vault, lots of pop. We like the quickness of that mm -hmm. vault. It's getting better each week. Little leg separation that we're working on. And uh, of course, you know, this is our third meet and the kids know that as we move forward, start rolling into the m February and mm -hmm. March, that um, sticking landings and, and, and perfect execution is going to be critical. And the fabulous freshman Kennedy Edney in the number four spot on the vaulting. She helped really set up the last two powerful vaults. Well, Kennedy, but look at this vault. She lands <laughs> it, she sticks it, and then she takes a step. So, you know, that's just, that's just a little immaturity, a little bit of uh -huh. freshman right there. But she gets better each week. Um, very excited about that one. Then um, the last two vaults, Maya Hambrick, this was her first week. This was her debut sure. on her one and a half vault. And mm -hmm. Bob has kind of paced her along. And that was her target date to do that vault. She warmed up three or four of them and then, you know, did one and warm up. So we got five one and a half vaults on Friday night in the PMAC, which was probably more important mm -hmm. than the competition vault itself. It was really great. Yeah. And then Bugs Nat. <laughs> 
does her usual fantastic vaulting 9-9 to wrap up a 49-325 team score. Propels you right into the second rotation, yeah. Didi. And right off the bat, you knew something was going to happen special on bars because you, you totally absolutely killed it over there for a new season high school. Well, you know, Shay Zamardi, who was our anchor last year, is certainly capable of, of really high scores in that event. Um, her bar routine is nice. She had good swing, great handstands, and, and one step on the dismount. You know, that, that's a, a senior that needs a little bit more discipline mm -hmm. because we see it stuck all the time in practice. Uh, Maya Hambrick, beautiful routine. Execution was fabulous. Handstands were great. We were excited about this night because it was our target night mm -hmm. to get Ruby Harold in a couple of events, which allowed us to take some kids out of events mm -hmm. and, and rest them. So we took bugs out of bars, inserted Ruby, Ruby. Harold, and mm -hmm. bars is her event. And uh, I think you're going to see the uniqueness in this routine. Beautiful, beautiful skills that you don't see all the time. Nice high release move and uh, sets her up to a double front dismount. Uh, which, you know, she didn't stick. You see, that's the dismount right sure. there. That's a tenth dis that's a tenth deduction there. But uh, that's just gonna get better and better each week. And then how about Lexi Priestman? Brings it home for the Tigers yeah. with a nine eight five. But a couple of shout outs right off the bat to Maya Hambrick and of course to Sarah Finnegan. Season high scores yeah. on the bars, Didi, a 49-450 season high score for the team, and it set you up beautifully for the second half of yeah. the meet against Texas Mormons. And you know, you mentioned Sarah Finnegan. She's in the all-around. So right. I'm glad you brought that up, Mike, because her vault was great. Her, her bar routine was terrific. Let's see how she does in the other two events. And when we come back, we'll take a look at those next two events inside LSU Gymnastics. We'll be right back. This gymnastics moment brought to you by Sigma Engineering. Sigma Engineers and Constructors. Safety, relationships, quality, excellence. Engineering done right. The best moment was probably finishing my Florentine. I safely say I've never had so much fun competing a Florentine. Um, normally before a floor I get I quite anxious and quite nervous about what's going to happen, but I was so relaxed, so chill. Um, and it was just so much fun to just do what I do and enjoy the moment. You're a mom the moment you see that second line. And it's time to get ready, because this birthday takes months to plan. Find the doctor who just clicks with you. Make a birth plan that's right for you. Because every woman wants something different, even you and your BFF. And when it's finally time, our doctors and nurses will be by your side as you bring your beautiful baby into this world. The best birthday ever is at Woman's. Big guy. All I wanted was a chance to play today. You know it's tough, kid, but we've both been in your shoes before. Yeah, right. You guys are great. Come on, I have someone you want to meet. You know the only way to become great is to learn from a legend. Billy Cannon! Hey, gang, come on in here. We're going to talk some football. More people than ever are choosing Nissan, making us North America's fastest growing auto brand in 2016. Take on 2017 and get the safety you'd expect. And America's best truck warranty. Get to Nissan's Take on 2017 event and save up to 2,500 on the 2016 Sentra or save up to 5,000 on the 2016 Altima. Get to Nissan, a proud partner of the LSU Tigers. Go Tigers! At LSU, we're pretty competitive. We helped prove Einstein's theories about gravity. Nailed it. France designated our French program as a center of excellence. We've discovered 41 species of birdies. LSU, we're pretty competitive because we're here to win. Oh, Dee Dee, we're so excited that we just wanted to get some extra vaults in. Vaulting for victory, right? Holy cow! Holy cow! LSU gymnastics tickets are less than the movies and fun for the family. Tickets start at just $3, so make sure to get yours today. 
This segment of Inside LSU Gymnastics is brought to you by TJ Ribs. TJ Ribs, legendary Louisiana barbecue. Welcome back, Inside LSU Gymnastics. Well, this week, our exceptional performer of the week, brought to you by Woman's Hospital, the best birthday ever is at Woman's. It's going to go, I think, Dee Dee, we got to give it to Ruby Harold, a 9875 and a 985 in her first floor and first bars as a Tiger. Well, she was excited about having the opportunity, and I think she called it Give It A Go. Give It A Go. And she, <laughs> she did all we needed her to do. Right now, we need her to, to get in her groove, to, to begin to find her competition self. Um, after the Olympics and two years of training for the Olympics, she needed a break, mm. and now we're trying to reintroduce her to her very best gymnastics, and we saw two great events out of her. We're excited about that, but we're going to get more. Well, we sure will. I had a chance to speak to her right after the meet, and I loved to ask said, Ruby, what did you think about competing in front of 12,000 people in the PMAC? And she said, it was just mad. <laughs> it was really great. <laughs> of course, she's going to be really, really fun to watch in the coming four years as an LSU yeah. Tiger. And speaking of fun, the balance beam on Friday night. Dee, your team, 49-3-5 on the event. It, you just started off so great again with Aaron McAdeg. Well, you know what? Let's not talk about the scores. Let's watch the quality <laughs> of the performance Good here. Call. Our first two people, Aaron McAdeg, she nailed it. Everything was absolutely Aaron, what you want your first person to do. Performance that's good enough to be at the end of our lineup, certainly. Then she followed, you know, follows by um, Maya Hambrick, right. who goes up and does a fabulous routine. Once again, someone that's good enough to be at the end of that lineup. Mm -hmm. So we're starting our lineup with two of our very best beam workers, which is, I think, a real bonus for us as we move forward in our season. And it allows you to take a freshman in Kennedy Edney, who earned a spot in the right. lineup again this week, in the number four spot, and again, she absolutely nails it. Did a great job. You know, we, we continue to polish that routine, and, and every time she competes, she gets a little more confidence. And, you know, self-confidence is the first prerequisite to great undertakings. And um, she is... Every time we put her out there, she gets a little bit more confident. Pretty soon we're going to see cockiness, which is, <laughs> which is a great quality and a good performer. Well, it was the first beam effort for Kennedy yeah. Edney as a Tiger, and it was a 9-8-2-5 performance in a critical spot, the number four lineup, number four spot in the lineup, and it absolutely sets you up to just bring it home. Well, you know, she's followed by two, two great beam workers. Sarah Finnegan, fabulous job. We, we have a... A code and we try to live by it if, if Sarah Finnegan has a break in front of her she doesn't do the triple turn mm -hmm. and I, when I told her that she's like oh really I, <laughs> I wanted to do it tonight I said well let's not let's just practice what we said we we're going to do and see how that goes beautiful beautiful nine, nine, routine 9925 nine, mm -hmm. could have been a 10 beautiful routine um, and then it sets up bugs we're you know we had a little break in one of our earlier routines so the pressure is on Ashley Nat to step up there and so we don't have to count a, mm -hmm. I think it was a 9-6, we don't right. have to count a low score, right. and she did just exactly what we needed her to do. It was a season high, in fact, for yeah. Bugs, a 9-9-2-5 score, who was only in three events this week, as you talked about at the top, mm -hmm. but you know, the Tigers in the home, eh, the crowd just comes to their feet for that fourth rotation. The, the floor exercise, yeah. Dee so powerful. Well, the, you know, our floor choreography is so good and, and such a key part of, of what we do week in and week out and Sunday evenings usually we have a good chance to work with Ashley on our floor routines and we've got two or three other other students and mm -hmm. athletes that we're trying to get into that lineup um, but to, to see Sydney Ewing start off with right. such a great routine um, to rebound because she's a little break on beam but she steps out here and does a fabulous with with absolute impeccable I call it dart landings mm -hmm. it was a beautiful routine and then she sets up Jay Zamardi who starts with a double Arabian um, nice landing and just flows through her routine I thought a much better routine than we saw the, the previous week and I'd like to just pause right there and give credit to those two seniors for starting your floor again season high scores yeah. nine eight seven five nine nine for yeah. Sid and Shay back to back. I don't back. want you to remind me that we've got three seniors in that event. Nah. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> That's, uh, but those That's two, leadership yeah, is what that those is. Those two did a great job. And then right in the middle of that lineup, you got Sarah Finnegan, who um, absolutely was perfect. And I, you know, I don't like to point out the, the negatives, but she was so perfect in the beginning of that routine. And we're working on an all around score, trying to get her in good solid four event standings. And uh, a little bit short, kind of ran out of gas, I think, a little bit in that last tumbling pass. Got a 9-6, which probably was exactly the right score. And um, 
cost her a little bit in the all around, but she still won the all around in the Absolutely. meet. Absolutely. But then, set up the last, I set up the power <laughs> at the end of that lineup. You took the words right out of my yeah. mouth, Dee Dee. Ruby Harold, the fans were absolutely dying mm -hmm. to see Ruby on the event. She walks out with a huge smile on yeah. her face. Yeah, she's, she's ready to go. And we, we know that, uh, that she's got a lot of great gymnastics in her, and we want to, you know, take it a day at a time, a step at a time, and continue to polish, get, you know, get things cleaner than they are right now. But she sure supported the middle of that lineup, went after Finnegan, got us going again, and then set up the last two kids that are just dynamic. Kelly and Nat, the back-to-back -back yeah. dynamic duo to end the floor for the Fighting Tigers. And on the evening, the Tigers do finish with a 197-475 team score. Dee Dee, you're off and running, and it looks like a fantastic rest of the season. Can't wait to talk about it some more, and we'll do that right after this timeout inside LSU Gymnastics. When you find the home you want to buy, choose a mortgage lender that can help you buy it. David Alello with Assurance Financial. David specializes in helping first-time home buyers, offering conventional FHA, VA, RD construction, and jumbo loans. David takes the hassle out of getting a home loan while making you feel right at home. Lending the way you like it. Call David today at 921-8152. That's 921-8152. David Alello with Assurance Financial. You're a mom the moment you see that second line. And it's time to get ready, because this birthday takes months to plan. Find the doctor who just clicks with you. Make a birth plan that's right for you. Because every woman wants something different, even you and your BFF. And when it's finally time, our doctors and nurses will be by your side as you bring your beautiful baby into this world. The best birthday ever is at Woman's. experience miracles dozens of times a day introducing the sports app on the all-new contour from Cox it's cable TV reimagined to get you right to the good stuff Cox official communications partner of LSU athletics Foundation, preserving the past, celebrating the present, and building the future of LSU athletics. Take it up, Dave. Take it up, Dave. You ready? Let's get it, Let's get it, right? Let's get it. 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 let us get it let us get it let us get it let us get it let us Team on one, team on one, one, team. This segment of Inside LSU Gymnastics is brought to you by Sigma Engineers. Sigma Engineers is thankful to our clients who trust us year after year and to the commitment of our selfless employees who bring such great talents to our company. With experts in every discipline, our dedication to safety and quality sets us apart as one of the leaders in the petrochemical industry. Welcome back Inside LSU Gymnastics. You know, Dee, one of the things that we're so proud of here in LSU Gymnastics is all of the social media activity that oh, we really, really do. Amazing. It's some of the best in the NCAA. Yeah. And we're adding something new this week, and it's LSUgym.com, which has actually been a brainchild for quite a while. Yeah, um, you know, Jay has so many great ideas, and when you couple his great ideas with the talent and the things that we have, our resources at LSU, our, our, our branding person, our, our graphics person, our, all of those people that work together and I think we'll see a feature on this that's right but um, it takes a village yep. and that is such a strong part of what LSU has to offer well Garrett Walbert is going to take you behind the scenes now to the new lsugym.com it's your first look at this brand new website this week's inside feature brought to you by Sigma Engineering Sigma engineers and constructors safety relationships quality excellence engineering done right vibrant informative 
cutting edge. LSUGym.com is a multi-purpose website aimed at reaching all demographics, including prospective student-athletes and Tiger fans across the globe. The site is a proficient mix of contemporary news and videos, historical guides, and social media content. Its design facilitates fluid viewing via phone, tablet, or conventional computer. Associate Head Coach Jay Clark was enthusiastic to help develop the website with LSU's Creative Services Department. Well, I think for several years what we've been trying to do in our social media and, and our web presence and in our recruiting efforts and in our marketing efforts is to try and find a way where we could create a hub where both fans, recruits, um, any, anyone who's seeking information about our program could go to one place and really be able to um, kind of research anything they want to know about our program, keep up with what's happening currently. They can, they can see what we're doing on a social media uh, platform. They can also see what's going on on campus, and they can do it all within the confines of one website, and that's, that's been a big advantage for us. Uh, when we were playing back in the fall, looking towards this season, we saw the old uh, media guide was kind of outdated and a lot uh, harder to kind of put together, and it required a lot of different resources, and we kind of wanted to go through one place to create or to hold everything that we needed. Uh, this website's really easy to, you know, edit and upload things and the whole part that we wanted or that we looked at was the simplicity of it and that was the most important part. It communicates the gymnastics program so well. It's easy to use, easy to navigate, find what you want to look at. There's fun stuff on there. You can see video. You can get to know the team. You can get to know the coaches. You can look around the LSU campus. You can support the program. You can get meet day information. It's just a really wonderful tool for the LSU gymnastics program. When it comes to social media, it's called fans and followers and the program has an incredible following, especially in recent years um, when we're filling this, the arena with more than 10,000 on most nights. And this gave us an opportunity to put the best of LSU gymnastics, all the videos, all the 360s, all the great history, all in one spot where anyone could access it at any time from their mobile device. Oh, it's incredible. Um, it's, it was a lot of work, and I'm thankful for a graphic designer like Stephanie who really did a majority of the work in placing videos and placing text. But I mean, if it enables our coaching staff to recruit the best athletes in the country and it allows our fans to get the most news, the most information possible, then it's, it works perfectly. And so far, it's been great. Reporting for Inside LSU Gymnastics, I'm Garrett Wolverd. What's wrong, big guy? All I wanted was a cast to play today. You know it's tough, kid, but we've both been in your shoes before. Yeah, right. You guys are great. Come on. I have someone you want to meet. You know the only way to become great is to learn from a legend. Billy Cannon! Hey, gang, come on in here. We're going to talk some football. When you find the home you want to buy, choose a mortgage lender that can help you buy it. David Alella with Assurance Financial. David specializes in helping first-time home buyers, offering conventional FHA, VA, RD construction, and jumbo loans. David takes the hassle out of getting a home loan while making you feel right at home. Lending the way you like it. Call David today at 921-8152. That's 921-8152. David Alello with Assurance Financial. Today is your day to play. Get the top brands for low prices every day. Academy. 1977. Disco, bell bottoms, and Ford F-Series starts its epic run as the best-selling trucks in America. 
2017, F-Series is still king for 40 straight years. Why? Rock-solid durability, up to the nanosecond technology, and jaw-dropping capability. Ford F-Series, America's best-selling trucks for 40 straight years. Get an F-150 with 0 for 60, plus current F-Series owners get an additional 4000 in owner loyalty cash on a new 2016 F-150, only at your Southern Quality Ford dealer. At LSU, we're pretty competitive. We helped prove Einstein's theories about gravity. Nailed it. France designated our French program as a center of excellence. We've discovered 41 species of birdies. LSU, we're pretty competitive because we're here to win. LSU Tigers fans, show your pride with real Tigers gear from the official online store, lsushop.net. You'll find everything a Tigers fan needs, including jerseys, sideline gear, polos, t-shirts, hats, and more. With an awesome selection of products, including official team merchandise from Nike, when it comes to Tigers pride, there's only one place real Tigers fans go, lsushop.net. This segment of Inside LSU Gymnastics is brought to you by Assurance Financial. When you find the home you want to buy, choose a mortgage lender that can help you buy it. David Alello with Assurance Financial. Lending the way home buyers prefer it. As always, our look ahead is brought to you by David Alello of Assurance Financial. Lending the way home buyers prefer it. And our look ahead, Dee Dee, we're going to Kentucky, a much improved Kentucky uh, gymnastics program in an environment that'll be challenging for the Tigers. I know you're looking forward to it. We are, you know, and, and it gives us another opportunity to, to begin to solidify our lineup. Mm -hmm. You know, last, last home meet, you got to see Ruby Harrell, you got to see Maya Hambrick, you know, show, showcase her one and a half, her new vault. But um, I think Kennedy Edney did four events. She we sure did. Didn't do floor in the lineup. We put our exhibition on the last event, and her floor routine brought the house down. I think, I think it's still buzzing over it there. It was so much fun for her. <laughs> she, I don't think she was expecting a standing ovation on an exhibition routine. Well, not only will the Tigers go on to the road for uh, uh, four more road events in the, uh, yeah. in the 2017 uh, season, but also four home meets as well, two on Fridays, two on Sundays. So we encourage you to go to lsutix.net. Claim your tickets now because there just weren't very many left this past Friday night. Dee. Yeah, you know what? If you have season tickets and you can't come, give them to somebody. That's because right. It's an exciting event. We want people to really come out and enjoy it. Again, just four opportunities at home, four on the road, and the Kentucky meet. It's a 6 o'clock Central Time start, SEC Network Plus once again, so you can watch it on all of your mobile devices at the SEC Network Plus. It's going to be a fantastic meet against Kentucky in yeah. Lexington for the Fighting Tigers. Well, for DD Bro, I'm Mike Smith. We thank you, as always, for joining us inside LSU Gymnastics. We'll see you next week.